happens is you create a fear of loss to where the member will think that if I come back tomorrow, I can't get the same deal. Unless you know for sure the deal's gonna change, and sometimes it does, then you, can, you can't fear of loss somebody. Can't fear of loss somebody. Mm -hmm. Can't fear of loss at all, not at Costco. It's, 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 it's just, you don't have to. Because um, you know, if, you, if you do your job correctly, you know, it's, like I said, it's not a sell. But you don't want somebody to think like they can't come back tomorrow and get the same deal. Yeah. Or they're gonna miss out on something, right? Unless we know for sure that's gonna be the case. Cool? Um, how you doing today? So, how you doing? The first thing is you gotta see what Costco is doing for members. Okay? So what I wanna do is um, I'm going to have you guys line up right here, right? Because we're gonna make this interactive. Cool? Switch real quick. So I want you to stand right here. And I'm gonna be the customer. Okay, you guys just line up right here. And one by one, we're gonna go through the, 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 the pitch real quick. I know this is weird. This is what we do. We practice, we practice just like in football. Tackle the hit. This is how we interact. We get the marbles out of our mouth here. So that way when you guys in the field, you know obviously you guys are averse with it or whatnot. So uh, Kevin, you're gonna go first. So the first thing I want you to do is, hey, how you doing today? As I walk like right here, when I get right here, you guys see what Costco is doing for members? You want me to you want me to kind of get my attention? And then as I get here, you want to kind of put your hands down here to get them to stop. Right? So how you doing today? Hey, do you guys see what Costco is doing? At home, do you guys use cable or salad? You want them to stop, right? You don't want to piss the customer if they're walking, right? So the idea is to get them to stop, or get them to stop by your kiosk. So you want to create that interaction 10 feet away, right? So you want to kind of get eye contact with me, smile, right? Hey, how's it going? Hey, what's up, man? Not much, how are you doing? Real quick, have you seen what Costco's got going on for its members? Um, no, what's going on? Yeah, mind me asking, you got TV or cable? Yeah, cable, we have satellite. So the more interactive you can be with your hands, the better. So hey, how you guys doing today? <clears throat> hey, do you guys see what Costco is doing for members? At home, do you use cable or do you have satellite for your TV service? Right, it's all interactive. It's weird, I know. Trust me, it was weird for me when I first started my first day. I was like, eh? Right, but it, it works, right? So you're just like, hey, how you doing today? Hey, did you guys, did you guys see what Costco is doing for members? Right, it's kind of a universal stop, right? Once you get them stopped, no, what's going on? At home, do you guys use cable or do you use satellite? Okay. Hey, sir, how's it going? Hey, what's up? How much, how are you doing? You got a cable or satellite? No, no, so first, it's all good, it's all good, stop. You want me to stop? Hey, how you doing in here? Uh, come here. So, come on. <laughs> Hey, how you doing today? I'm doing good, how you doing? Hey, real quick question for you. What's going on? Hey, uh, did you guys see what Costco's doing for members? Uh, no, what are you guys doing? At home, do you guys use cable or do you use satellite for your TV service? Uh, right now we have cable. You have cable? Mm -hmm. Is that the bundle, like the internet and the phone? Yeah, we got everything. The reason I'm asking is a lot of members are the same, the pricing keeps going up. Have you noticed that at all? Yeah, just went up recently. That's exactly why we're here. Let me show you what we're doing. Okay. I'm not gonna burn the back to the table, all right? So we're just gonna do the initial aspect of it, guys. So, hey, how you doing today? Hey, did you guys see what Costco's doing for members? You know, hey, real quick, hey, did you see what Costco's doing for members? Get them to stop, right? At home, do you guys use cable or do you have satellite for your TV service? Hey, how's it going, sir? Hey, what's up? Real quick, have you seen what Costco's got going on for its members? No, what's going on? Uh, real quick, do you have uh, cable or do you have satellite? Right now, I'm using Cox. Yeah, they are a bunch so of you, so so you guys right so so you guys you guys want to you guys want to recognize body language right so if, you know the way you want to say it is you want them to leave like yeah you know I do like cars like yeah we get a lot of complaints and your voice inflection the more you can really um, play on that the better you know you'll get the customer you know obviously uh, build that rapport and hear what you're saying so you're good so go right here oh, okay yeah. Hi, how are you doing? What's up? Real quick, do you know what Costco is doing um, for members? Did you hear what Costco is doing for members? Did you, did you hear what Costco is doing for members? No, what's going on? Okay, real quick, do you have cable or satellite? Right now I'm using Cox. Okay, um, well let me show you what we do. Perfect. Yeah. Cool. All right, cool. Okay. Well, okay. I'm going I'm to add the next the piece. I'm at, I'm at, I'm at, once you guys go through, I'm going to add the next piece. Oh, okay. Hi, how are you doing? Hey, what's up? Huh? You keep your feet planted. So we don't walk You don't, No. So you keep your feet planted because what's going to do is going to get the, you want them to you come to you. You want to draw them in. Yeah, so, so you keep your, because you, you got to keep in mind too, guys, they're in the aisle, right? They don't want us attacking their customers. So we don't want to come to them. We want them to come to us. So the more friendly, hey, how you doing today? Hey, do you guys see what Costco is doing for members? You know, at home, do you guys use cable or do you have satellite? They're like, oh, you use Cox. It's like, would you keep your feet planted and you want them to stop? 
Because when you move, they're going to move. Right? You want them to stop. Because you need them to get back to your table. Because that's where that's your home field. So you're bringing them in mm -hmm. rather than walking them off the table. Yes, sir. Fair enough. Hi, how are you doing? Hey, what's up? Uh, not much. Have you heard what Costco is doing for for its customers? No, what's going on? Well, do you have a cable or do you have cable or do you have a satellite? Satellite. Right now I'm using Cox. Oh, great. Perfect. Let me show you what All we're right. doing. Cool. Hi, sir. How are you doing today? Hey, what's up? Um, I'm doing all right. I just wanted to find out if you uh, if you knew what uh, Costco was doing for its members. Did you hear what Costco is doing for it? You want to use eye contact, smile, enthusiasm. you got to be excited, right? Because this is where you start to create that report. They're going to judge you within the first 30 seconds. They're going to they're gonna, they're gonna okay, stereotype you. Start over. Right? <laughs> so within the first 30 seconds, they want to, they wanna, they, if you don't look like, like approachable, they're not going to want to talk to you. Right? So you got to understand within the first 30 seconds, they're grading you. Right? So you don't want to be too over animated because you don't want to come off as too salesy. But wait, there's more. You don't want to be that guy. <laughs> right? But you also want to be, hey, how you doing? Hey, did you guys see who Costco's? You want to kind of create that, you know, that energy or whatnot. So smile, eye contact, enthusiasm. Hi, right, how you doing today, sir? Hey, what's up, man? Oh, nothing much. Just right here. Just wanted to know, did you, did you know what uh, Costco has going on for its members? No, what's going on? Uh, well, one question. Do you have cable or do you have satellite? At home, are you guys using cable or do you guys use satellite? Right? You want to make it... Because people like to buy, but they hate to be sold. So the minute that you show what you're doing, they're going to build up a barrier. So you kind of want to take a more of a like, eh, no, I saw, hey, you guys, you guys use cable, you guys use, use satellite, right? Because the more you show your salesman, like, approach, the more they're going to back up. Because they're going to be like, you're trying to sell me something that I don't need, rather than let me show you how this can help your situation. Follow, follow me? Yeah. Look it up. Come on. Hey, how are you doing today? Hey, what's up? Hey, just a real quick question. Do you know what the Costco is doing for its customers? Uh, no, what's going on? Do you have cable at home or do you have salad? Yeah, I'm using Cox. Uh, I, I heard the prices are going up. Yeah. Can you come with me real quick? Perfect. Cool. Hi, how's it going? Hey, what's up? Hi, quick question. What's uh, up? Have you heard what Costco is doing for its new members? No, what's going on? So, quick question. Do you have cable at home or do you have satellite? Yeah, I'm using Cox. Okay, great. So, have you heard of this? Yeah, yeah. perfect. Perfect. Let me make a suggestion. What's up? Because I've been, <coughs> I had a lot of hard time. This is my second time going through here. It's the more times you keep saying, "Can I ask you a question, real quick?" Don't okay. ask. Don't. Yeah. They'll, take. They'll the, so you know how turning off. You know how. You know how number eight was take, take control, right? When you ask permission, like, "Hey, let me show you what we're doing," or "Can I show you what we're doing?" or "Will you come over and follow me?" They won't. You just. Come you have to take agent. control. So, so, so you so, say, "Just uh, let me ask you a quick question." That's the only question from there. It's just curious. Do you have okay. cable or satellite? Yeah, and so and that's 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 a great point right there because if you ask them, you got to take control. Because if you ask them, they're not gonna. You give them an option that you know, obviously. They know what's going to happen. They, they, they're going to be. They're going to get the, the yeah. mangoes across the street. Yeah. Hi, how you doing? Hey, what's up? Quick question. Do you uh, know what Costco's doing for its members? No, what's going on? Are they you use cable or satellite? Mode? Um, right now I'm using uh, Cox. Oh, okay, good. You hear about the prices going up over there? Okay, so the first thing you want to. Okay, so that's good. So you guys have gotten off of the initial aspect of it. So hey, how you doing today? Hey, did you guys see what Costco is doing for members? Right. You don't <laughs> want to say. Quick question, and the reason why you don't want to say quick question is because they've heard it a million times, right? Mm -hmm. They heard, so your thought process is, I need to find creative ways to create conversation with this person because we've been in these stores for seven years. They've, that whole quick question, they're like, I know that. As soon as you say quick question, they're like, I, I heard that before. Mm -hmm. So you don't want to say quick question. You know, and it's not what you say, it's how you say it. Hey, did you guys, hey, and I, I'll, I'll even go as, hey, did you hear? And I'll be quiet, and I'm like, hear what? Like at home, you guys do, and then now I got the objective is just to get their attention. Curious. Hey, hey, just curious. Do you know? And then, and then, and then you, you, they'll be walking by, and you'll be like, hey, just curious. And they'll be like, and you just be quiet. And then they'll stop and be like, just curious what? At home, you guys, and I got them to stop, right? Uh, and it's funny because you'll watch them take two or three steps and then just stop. And then you'll be like, you guys still using Cox at home for your TV service? Right, and you got to be able to read and recognize. And so, when um, when when you when you when you get to that point where you're like, uh, do you guys hear what we're doing? You guys still using cable or satellite at home for the TV service? Once they say they have cable, then we have to identify uh, if they have the bundle. You guys still using the bundle, like the internet and the phone? 
they're gonna be like, oh no, I just have TV and internet, or oh no, I have, and the key is, is that when they, ask, when they tell you this information, you don't wanna ask the same question twice. This information is important. Sometimes we, we get on autopilot when we get to this point, and we start to focus when we get back to the table, you want to you don't want to ask the same questions twice so you want to gather the information go ahead how does the bundle affect the so like, good, good question okay. so with cox right yeah. so cox is a great communications company mm -hmm. the internet with cox is going to be one of two prices or actually one of three prices but really one of two because these are the two most common so the the, the <coughs> uh, blast internet with cox is 70 dollars 90% of Vegas has this internet right here. Oh, so this us is, knowing what they're involved with mm -hmm. tells us they're, what they're paying. This is going to be, um, I think, 100 meg download speed? Yes. 100 meg download speed. This is like for you know Netflix, you know tablets. 90% of the customers are going to have this internet. So when you quote Cox for the internet, so like let's say, for instance, you're like, uh, is Geneva? <laughs> Geneva. So Geneva, how much do you pay for your bundle? They're like, well, I pay 180 for my bundle. Okay, is that the cable, the internet, and the phone? You're gonna be like, oh no, it's just the cable and the internet. Okay, so you're actually really smart for being with Cox for your internet. With your internet, do you do any like online gaming or stock trading, or is it just basic high-speed internet? Now, they have one tier that's higher than this, which is like uh, 300 megs. And it's for people that have like businesses in their home. So they, they're doing like stock trading where they have to have it constantly refreshing or whatnot. And or, or heavy gamers, they'll know that they have the higher tier internet. The higher tier internet is 119. Okay, we know this for sure because we sell Cox here in this office. Okay. So you have to be confident when you talk about this because if you use doubt words like about, almost, approximately, it's going to be about seventy eight dollars. It's going to be a almost seventy eight dollars. If you're not sure about it, it's going to create confusion. That customers are going to be like, hey, I need to come back when I'm sure the information is accurate, yeah. right? So um, you need to be experts when it comes to this. It's either 78 or 119. So $78 is what you pay for your internet speed. I know this for sure because this is how I have it set up at my house. We're gonna keep this the same. What I wanna focus on is the 102 that you pay for your, uh, for your um, cable. You see how I did that? Okay, simple math, right? You just subtract. The, that's why you ask them for the bundle because we have to itemize their bill, right? For the phone, there's there's um, there's the basic phone package which is thirteen dollars with Cox. There's a twenty-two dollar package which has caller ID, call waiting, call hold, conference calling. It's a little bit you know upgraded, and you have access to long distance, meaning like I can call domestic long distance, but it's per per minute, it's like twenty-two cents, ten cents, whatever it may be to call it long distance, and then there's a one above that, which is international, which you have access to international long distance, same thing per minute, is $35. And they'll know which one they're on. When I ask them, so you have the bundle with Cox, you have the cable, the internet, and the phone, they're like, yeah, you know, I got all three services. Do you use your phone or do you have it just for the bundle? Right? The reason I want to ask this is because when you sign up with Cox, Cox is going to say, hey, um, it's going to be cheaper to get all three services initially. Right, 99 bucks, get the three services, right? You're like, yeah, I'll take that. What happens is, is after the promotion expires, because we all have promotional offers, then the promotions expire, you're paying for all three services. Does that make sense? And that's why your bill goes up. So sometimes you'll get a customer that'll walk up and be like, man, I'm paying 250, when I started it was $99, now it's 250. Oh, okay. Okay, well what happened was, when you signed up, you signed up for all three services, when all you need is two, and you're paying for that third service, okay. and you really don't need it. So I'm gonna ask you, do you use your phone or do you have it just for the bundle? Oh, I don't really use it. If, I, if you don't use the phone, I'm not gonna include it in the price because I'm not gonna make you pay for a service you don't use. Go so ahead. the 119, that would be for the bundle. No, the 119 is for the 300 meg. So the more expensive. This is the more expensive internet. internet. That's more expensive internet, yeah. This is the more expensive internet, this is the regular oh, internet. There's one below it, but these are like older people that like, there's one below it that not a lot of people have. So we can't sell it, right? Now we sell it. We don't sell the internet. Right. We just educate them on what's it going to be. So we can't sell it. You need to know the price. You need to know the price so you can itemize it, yeah. right? And what they're going to tell you is they're going to say, hey, Richmond, I, when I, no, I'm paying $49 for my internet now because that's what they see on their bill. But what we're going to tell them is like, hey, so Quincy, when you, when you, when you separate it, that's what your bill is going to be. 
Right now you're paying 49 because it's in the it's in the bundle price. Once you separate this, what your price is gonna be. But I'm gonna show you how it's still gonna work out to be less than what you're paying now. Oh, so you have to separate the bills for now because they're paying the bundle and that's the final break. You have to break it up for them. Okay, I see. They have to keep the internet and the phone the same. Mm -hmm. Now, but what if they want our, our bundle? Do we, we don't offer a bundle. We don't offer a bundle. So we just say all I can just do is just TV service. It's not that big of an issue. It's, you're overthinking it. Yeah. I promise you, it's not. It's not a big deal. Because in the end, it's just going to be like we're giving them like people. Pe off. People. People think that because it's the bundle, they think they're going to save money. Bundle has a stigma behind it because everybody wants to be in the bundle, and they don't even know why they want to be in the bundle just because it's cool to be in the bundle, right? <laughs> it's like you know what I mean. But um, really, a bundle all it does is camouflage the pricing to where you don't know what you're paying for what. Yeah. Right, and then you sometimes have a service that you really don't need. So what if they for. don't know what the bills are separately? You know, you're, oh, you're okay. the expert. Oh, yeah, nah. okay. You're the expert. <laughs> That's where you gotta be the expert. Okay. Because if you don't know, it's gonna create confusion. You're not gonna sign them up. You won't get past this point because you gotta be you gotta be experts when it comes to this. It's not hard. It's only like a couple different pricings. So this is Cox Internet. This is Cox Phone. Then there's CenturyLink. CenturyLink, yeah, CenturyLink takes up about thirty percent of our market. Thirty percent. So it's not a lot. Okay, the CenturyLink, um, you don't ever want to recommend somebody to switch from Cox to CenturyLink internet and phone. The reason being is because CenturyLink is hit or miss. Sometimes it's good, sometimes it's bad. If you suggest that somebody switches over to CenturyLink and they sign up and have a bad experience, they're going to come to Costco thinking that Costco backs CenturyLink and they don't. You follow me? Mm -hmm. So because of that, we don't offer... We don't try to suggest, like if they have CenturyLink, we suggest they stay with them and then keep it the same, we don't change that. But we don't ever try to suggest somebody, a service that we don't sell in the store, we don't try to sway somebody to sign up with that service. You follow me? Mm -hmm. Right? So with CenturyLink, um, they offer phone and internet. Their phone, what, 35 bucks a week? Uh, for what? For a phone for CenturyLink. Same with Cox, 35, 25, 50. Then what about the internet? What? Um, 30, 45, 55. So it's either 45 or 55. 55 for the up, upgraded tier, 45 for the lower graded tier. Always quote high. Because if, if you quote high and it's lower, you're good. If you quote lower and it's higher, you everything you said is a lie. You follow me? So always quote high when it comes to CenturyLink. I, was, I would always quote CenturyLink internet at $55. And I would quote their, um, their phone at 35 what was your question? You got a phone with it. So we need to itemize their bill. So when people say, hey, I'm paying 250, I'm paying 180, I'm paying 195, we know all of that's not all TV. So we have to itemize it to be able to identify what portion of it is TV so we can help them, you know, um, compare. What's up? So for the Cox, where's the cable service? I see the prices for the phone and the internet. Show. We don't care because we're, 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 the cable service is going to be whatever's left over. Mm -hmm. So what is that number? This number right here is 180 is the total bill right now, but then we have cable and internet. So when I separate the internet, this is what's left over for the cable portion. Where does 180 come from? Which seven, that's what they told me. Oh, that's what this is what they're going to tell. So when you ask a customer, when you ask them, so who do you have? Oh, I have Cox. Do you have the bundle, like the internet and the phone? They're like, yeah, I have cable and internet. Yeah, a lot of members. And instead of saying, what do you pay? I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to leave with, a lot of members have been complaining about the pricing going up. If you don't mind me asking, how much do you pay? Why well, pay like 180? 180? And then from there, I'll be able to go yeah. and look at that and see. If yeah, so when, when they say 180, right? I'm going to say, well, you got like 10 TVs, right? And they're like, no, I only got three. That's it. That, I, I just asked them, you know, how much, how many TVs they have, but in a manner that makes, you know, I'm always leading with a, with a leading question or a leading statement to get that answer I need. I'm not making an interrogation because if I ask them each question back to back, it's going to be like, well, you're trying to sell me something. But now I'm making it more of a conversation, right? So the next part of the, um, the, the, the hey, you can go right here. So we're gonna start with you. So you're gonna take it, the next part is, um, who do you have? Oh, I have cable, I have, I have Cox. Is that the bundle, like the internet and the phone? Okay? Okay, so we're, we already got you here, we stopped. <laughs> no, no, we're gonna go the whole thing. But we're gonna start, start from the yeah, start from the end. Hey, sir, how's it going? Real quick, uh, let me see what Costco's got going on for its members. No, what's going on? No, no, you don't say it real quick, but that's, you're doing good. Don't stop. All right. I was just curious. You, you see what Costco's got going on for its members? No, what's going on? Um, mind me asking, who do you got for, uh, you got cable, you got satellite? Right now I'm using Cox. And, and, you, and it might be like for, we, we, in a pitch, it teaches you to say cable or satellite. 
I'm just a little bit, I, me personally, I get more direct. You guys still using Cox at home for your TV service? I just get right to the point. I don't, that cable or satellite, listen. They'll tell you what they got. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So I just get, ask them, they're, 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 they're either gonna say, no, I don't have Cox, I have this, or they're gonna say, yes, I have Cox, right? So it's not, um, so you guys still using Cox at home? Uh, so you're still using Cox at home? Um, no, yeah, actually I do. I have the, the bundle with them. Oh, you bundle it. As you, a lot of HIP members are complaining that the prices are going up and up. Yeah. Is that something you have an issue with? Perfect. Okay, come on. You're good. So just go get go just into the bundle part. Okay. All right. Hi, how are you doing? Hey, what's up? Real quick, do you know what uh, Costco's doing? For <coughs> oh, what's going on? Okay, one thing. Do you have a cable or do you have satellite? Man, I'm using Cox right now. Okay, yeah, I've heard complaints about the prices going up. Okay, is that the bundle yeah. like the internet? Is that the bundle like the internet and the phone? Um, no, it's just internet and TV. Okay, awesome. Well, you know, blah, blah, blah. Perfect. Blah, 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 blah. blah. Okay. Hi, how are you doing? Hey, what's up, man? Have you heard what Costco's doing for its members? No, what's going on? Um, do you have cable? Or if you, if you guys remember the hand motions, it'll help you remember yeah, what you said. Yeah, so if you hand guys hand. use cable, or you have satellite. You guys use cable, or you guys use satellite? Man, I'm using right now, I'm using Cox. Oh, are you? Oh, okay. <laughs> <laughs> so let me show you what we is got. That the, is that the bundle, or like oh, the internet? Is that the bundle, or the internet cable? Is that the bundle, like the internet and the phone? They're gonna be like, yeah, it's internet and TV. Okay, and then you go into the next part. Go ahead, here. Hey, how are you doing? Hey, what's up? Hey, did you, did you hear what happens if Costco's giving to their members? Did you hear what Costco's doing for members? Did you hear what Costco's doing for the members? Oh, members? Uh, no, what's going on? Do you have cable or do you have satellite? Man, all right, I'm using Cox. Oh, do you have the bundle, like the TV and the internet? Yeah, it's just TV, internet, and phone. Oh, really? And the rest. I can't remember the first part. It's all good. It's all good. Hi, how's it going? Hey, what's up? Have you heard what Costco's doing for their members? No, what's going on? So, do you have cable or do you have satellite? Man, I'm using Cox right now. Okay, do you guys have like the bundle with all the phone and the TV and everything? Yeah, it's the bundle with the internet and phone. Okay. Perfect. <clears throat> See? She got it. I'm excited. Hi! Hey, what's up? Have you heard what Costco's doing for its members? No, what's going on? No, do you have uh, cable or do you have TV? Um, TV. That's like the bundle. With the <laughs> <Yeah. internet. laughs> no, I said, so you got cable or you have satellite? I got satellite. Cable or satellite? I got cable. Okay, cool. That's like the bundle with the TV and the internet and the Yeah, I got the, the phone. Well, no, just the internet and the TV. Okay, cool. Hi, how you doing? Hey, what's up? Did you hear what Costco's doing for his members? No, what's going on? Do you have cable or satellite? Right now I'm using Cox. Okay, so it's like the internet and the phone bundle type thing? Yeah, I have a, a bundle with just the internet and the TV. Okay. Okay, so the reason that I asked, this is the next question. So the reason I ask is because a lot of members have been complaining about the pricing going up. Right? If you don't mind me asking, how much are they get, getting you for? Right? That's why I say. Instead of saying how much are you paying, I just say how much are they getting us for? Right? And it's just verbiage that I use that you know works for me. So how much are they getting us for? And you're like, well, I pay like four, you know, you know, because some people will be like, oh, it's none of your business. And right? well, how much do you pay? And you're like, oh, it's none of your business. So the better approach for me is well, how much are you getting us for? Right, and then they'd be like, oh, 180 or whatever it may be, right? Hey, sir, how's it going? Hey, what's up? Uh, have you seen what Costco's got going on for its members? No, what's going on? Uh, you have uh, you have cable, you have satellite. Uh, right now, you're doing Cox. Cox, is that a bundle? You got TV, phone, and internet? Uh, just the TV and internet. Did, mind me asking, do your prices keep going? Say, the reason I'm asking. The reason I'm asking is your prices keep going. No, the up reason up. I'm asking is a lot of members have been complaining about <coughs> So say, so say, the reason I'm asking is because a lot of members have been complaining about the pricing going up. If you don't mind me asking, how much are they getting you for? How much are you getting us for? Right? So the reason I'm asking is, is we've been getting a lot of complaints because what we want to do is we want to gear them towards that thought process, like something's wrong. The reason I'm asking is because we've been getting a lot of complaints about the pricing going up. If you don't mind me asking, how much are they getting you for? Right? Right? Hey sir, how's it going? Hey, what's up? You see what Costco's got going on for its members? No, what's going on? Uh, you got uh, you got cable, you got satellite. Yeah, right now I'm using Cox. Uh, the reason I'm asking is we got a lot of complaints. Is that the about bundle? So the bundle. Those skip steps. It's good. It's good. And I know this. That's why I'm doing it step by step. And it's all right, guys. I'm not like you know. Don't feel nervous. Just think about what you're saying. So the first thing is, is how you doing today? Did you guys see what Costco is doing for members? You guys still using Cox for your TV service? Is that the bundle, like the internet and the phone? The reason I'm asking is we've been getting a lot of complaints, right? And I'm using this. I'm, I'm, the reason why I'm asking is we've been getting a lot of complaints about the pricing going up. If you don't mind me asking, how much did they get you for it? Right? Because that's kind of like an intrusive question. And then they're, they're, they're like, oh, well, I'm paying like 180. You don't mind me asking how much did they get you for it, right? 
So bundle first. If they have a bundle, then how much they pay? Good day, sir. How's it going? Hey, what's up? Do you see what Costco's got going on for its members? No, what's going on? Um, well, real quick, who do you got for, uh, you, uh, you got cable, you got satellite? Right now I'm using Cox. Is that the bundle with the TV code and the internet? Just an internet and a TV. Uh, great. Uh, the reason I'm asking? The reason I'm asking is we got a lot of members complaining that the prices keep going up and up. Mm -hmm. You have the same issue? Yeah, man, my price just went up to 210. Great, let me show you what we got going on. Perfect, right? So they're gonna say, you're gonna say, um, the reason why we've been asking is a lot of members have been complaining about the pricing going up. If you don't mind me asking, how much do they give you for? And be like, oh, I'm, I'm paying like. Yeah, it's all good, it's all good. And keep in mind, they don't know what you're supposed to say. Mm -hmm. So just remember the four things you need to know before you bring them right to the table. It does not matter the order that you get them in. Right, but you want to be as time efficient as possible. But you need to know these four things before you need to know who they have, what they have, if they're in a the bundle, how much they're paying, how many TVs. Right, or the four things are there. Cool. Sorry, that was fine. Hi, how you doing? Hey, what's up? Okay, awesome. Okay, awesome. All right, let's do this again. Okay. Stop there, right quick. I'm, my hand right here keeps <laughs> nervous. Me, me. Yeah. Hi, how you doing? Hey, what's up? Awesome. So, do you know what Costco's doing for its members? No, what's going on? Okay, well. <laughs> One question, do you have uh, cable or do you have satellite? Right now I'm using Cox. Okay, yeah, the reason I'm asking is because I hear about the, oh, the bundle. Shoot, okay. Um, is it the bundle, like the internet and the phone and the TV? Yeah, it's the TV and the internet. Yeah, okay, well the reason I'm asking is because I hear a lot about the prices going up. So how much are they getting right now? Uh, right now I'm pay my bill just went up to $205. Okay, yeah, let me just show you what we got. Okay, perfect, okay. turn burn, cool. And just, hey guys, look, you can cheat. Cheat right here. Don't don't be afraid. This is why it's here. So cheat. So who they have? If they're in a the bundle, how many TVs and how much they pay? Cool. And don't be nervous. It's all good. This, I don't expect you guys are actually doing a lot better, believe it or not, than normal because you guys are getting it like first time. Normally it takes two or three times for us to go through it. So don't don't put so much pressure on yourself. Hi, how you doing today? What's up? Uh, have you heard what Costco is going on for his members? No, what's going on? I just want to ask a question. Do you have cable or do you have satellite? Right now I'm using Cox. Oh, is that the bundle? The bundle, or is that the like the bundle, like yeah, the, the bundle, internet, internet and the TV? TV. Um, it's just the TV and the internet. Well, I've heard that members have been complaining about the prices going up. Man, who are you telling? My my bill just went up to three hundred dollars. Oh, is that right? Well, let me show you. Our <laughs> yeah, like the ten TVs, right? That's mentality. Like what? Like we got just let include your Obamacare, right? You know, just make a joke, right? Make a joke about it, right? And they're like, no, man. Oh, yeah. Yeah. And now you're like, okay, now you now you've sided with them, right? Oh, that's good. <laughs> right? Okay. You make a joke about it. You want to have fun, right? This remind like you if you have the more fun you can have, the more energy you bring. I just enjoy those shit. Hey, how are you doing there? Hey, what's up? Hey, do you have? Did you hear what? I never remember. Do you have? You know what cost is going on for the members? No, what's going on? Do you have cable at home or do you have satellite? Right now, I'm using Cox. Do you have the internet and the TV and everything, the bundle? Yeah, it's the internet and the phone. The reason why I'm asking is how much are you paying for it? Because the prices keep on going up. The reason. So that's perfect. The prices keep on going up. So the reason so, I'm asking is yeah. a lot of members have been complaining. Uh, about the pricing going up. Okay. If you don't mind me asking, how much you pay? You pay? And, and keep in mind, with the way you said it was not wrong. Your energy and your voice inflection was on point. Yeah. But just you know, get have it saying the reason I'm asking is a lot of members who complain about the pricing going up. That was, that was good. Yeah. That was right. good. Good stuff. Hey, how's it going? What's up? Have you heard what Fox is doing for its members lately? No, what's going on? Quick question: Do you have satellite or do you have cable? Right now, I'm using. Cable. Okay, do you have like the bundle with the internet and the phone and everything? Yeah, the internet and phone. Okay, the reason why I'm asking is I've been hearing a lot from a lot of our customers here at Costco that the prices are going up. So Who are you telling? <laughs> so I'm just wondering is how much are they getting you for? Right now I'm paying like 210 Oh wow, do you have like 10 TVs or something? That's just three. Oh wow, okay, here, let me show you what we have. That's exactly why, so get in the habit of saying that's exactly why we're here. Let me show you what we're doing. That's perfect. Good job. Hi. Hey, what's up? Uh, not much. Uh, Quick question, uh, okay. have you heard what Costco's doing for its uh, customers? So keep in mind, quick question is going to shoot you guys in the foot. So you don't, you don't want, uh, I know I've said that in the pitch and I talked to you, just try to take that out. The quick question and the reason why you don't want to say it is because they heard it a million times. They have, that are kind of like anything else you say is now void because of that quick question. So try to take that out of your pitch. Cool. All right. Hi. Hey, what's up? Hey, um. Did you see what Costco Have you heard what uh, Costco's doing for its customers? No, what's going on? Well. Do you have a satellite or do you have a cable? cable? Right now I'm using Cox. Oh, and that's like the bundle package with the TV and the internet? Yeah, what's the internet and phone? Oh, well the reason I'm asking is uh, because people have been complaining about the prices going up. Yeah, absolutely. Cool.
If you don't mind me asking. If you don't mind me asking, what are they getting you for? Uh, 210. Oh, that's exactly why we're here. Let me turn and burn them, right? Let me show you guys something. I'm going to teach you something real quick. Come here. You learned this from me. Okay. Everybody? Okay. Everybody? Oh dear. Here we go. Don't be quiet. Time to turn and burn. You see how you got burned? Turn and burn, but I, I, I lost because I, I lost because I turned around. But if I would walk out the door, you guys would follow me. But because I turned around, you guys, I, I lost, right? So that's that's the turn and burn, right? So when you get them to that point and you're like, let me show you what we're doing, you turn and burn back to the table. You do not look back at the person because if you do, you lose. Right, so it's kind of weird for some people because they're like, "Oh, it's almost disrespectful because now I'm turning, I'm talking to them, and then I'm turning my back and you know, I'm going this way." Right, but when you talk about take control, that's what we're talking about. Your home field advantage is at the table, right? So when you turn and burn them, you don't look back at the person. You just like, "Let me show you," and you bring them back to the table and you beeline back to the table, right? Because um, that's where your home field advantage. Everything you need to close them is at the table, right? Don't ask them. Don't say, "Hey, can I show you what we're doing?" Will you come over here and let me show you and do a pre No. That's exactly why I'm here. Let me show you. And you just turn and burn them. You go back to the table and it's going to be weird as hell because you're like, is this person following me? You're going to be like, but you, you get back to the table. You don't turn around. Trust. Just don't just trust. Don't turn around, right? Um, don't uh, don't um, just act like you're doing something or preparing your stuff. And then believe it or not, you'll turn around and they'll be walking right up to the kiosk and they'll be like, oh, okay, what do you got? And then you just go and do a presentation, okay? So good. So let's go. Hi, how you doing? What's up? Do you know what Costco's going for as members? No, what's going on? Do you have cable or satellite? Yeah, right now I'm using Cox. So it's like a, like the bundle with the internet and phone? Yeah, it's a bundle. Okay, so, uh, wait, 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 hold on, don't tell me. You're good, look. Okay, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> um, so I, ah, you good? Reason, just think about it. The reason I'm asking. Oh yeah, the reason I'm asking because some of the members have been complaining about the prices going up. Did it happen to you? Yeah, my, my bill just went up to 310. Man, that's like 10 TVs in your house? That's just two. Wow, come on, let me show you what we got. That's exactly why we're here. Let me show you. Exactly. Perfect. <laughs> Perfect. Yeah, all right. Go ahead. Write it down. Hey, sir, how's it going? Hey, what's up? Uh, have you heard what Costco's got going on for its members? No, what's going on? Uh, do, you have, uh, do you have cable or do you have satellite? Right now, I'm using Cox. Is that for the bundle? Is it's a bundle for... like internet and TV, yes. And then TV? Uh, the reason I'm asking? The reason why I'm asking is a lot of our members keep talking about the prices keep going up. Are you having that situation? My bill just went up to 210. Seriously? Is that for like 10 TVs? It's just two. Wow. Let me show you what we got going on. You just turn around. Cool? So that's 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 the hook, right? So you guys have got it down. Very basic. It's not hard. Um, what who they have, what what they have, how many TVs, and what they pay. That's the information we need we need to find out. We want to qualify. Um, the people before we bring them back to the table. Quality time for quality people, right? We want to make sure that they have that they, they, they know what we're talking about, right? One, three things that I look for is one, do they know what I'm talking about? And what I mean by that is like, you don't want to talk to somebody and then you get them back to the table and they're like, oh, this is Direct TV. I don't even have Direct TV, right? So one, they know what you're talking about, right? Two, they want to talk to you. I want to.